Hi, this is Karthi Monika Raj. Uh, I am going to explaining about Linux administration. Uh, in this level, I have started uh, the first topic as system admin information. Uh, before seeing system admin information, first uh, I give intro about me. I am Karthi Monika Raj. I have own Linux blog or Linux administration. In this blog, this is my blog name. In this blog, you are going to learn so many things uh, like uh, Linux administration, server level, remote level, network level, those kind of things I have explained in this blog. Uh, my blog name is uh, www.iatlinux.wordpress.com. Okay, uh, first I start the topic of uh, system admin information in Linux. Uh, now we're going to see so many basic information, also server important information for Linux with help of commands okay I have installed uh, Red Hat's EL 6.0 in VMware VMware orchestration and, uh, uh, and also I have connected through PuTTY okay the very first one how to view IP address view or check the IP address with using Linux command if config see the IP address 192.168.10.100 the next uh, if config is 0 it will show your particular interface uh, in this first command it shows both your interface also loopback IP in the second command I have to see the particular interface then uh, os name space iPhone i this is also used to see the your loopback IP address as well as your interface IP address yeah this is command to view your IP address okay then then second one when I install operating system using lost command lost grub WTMP see I have installed June 12 in 330 2030 so how to check when I install my operating system using command loss command and uh, with help of grub we had to filter the output WTMP so this is the date I have installed my operating system now currently is a September month but it shows June month I have installed four month before okay the next topic find total number of packages installed in this operating system okay using rpm command iphone qa it will query all the package and then iphone iphone lost wc iphone it will count the total number of package installed so in this machine i have installed 894 packages 894 packages I have installed in that my operating system okay the next one find the OS flavor which flavor I have installed OS distribution uh, with uh, help of command lsb underscore release sorry l a lsb underscore sorry i think this package is missing yum install lsb stop So we have to install that uh, LSB package. LSB underscore release hyphen A. It will show your uh, operating system complete name. See Red Hat Enterprise Linux Service Sorry Server Release 6.0. So this release version is 6.0. So this is the command used to 
check or find the OS distribution the next one find connected or discount so totally how many odd disk I have connected in my operating system current machine LS SCSI it will show your connected or disk name one by one see SDA1, SDB eh, sorry SDA, SDB, SDC, SDD totally see grab disk WC hyphen L totally I have connected four or disk SDA, SDB, SDC and SDD this is the command so this command is used to to view your how find sorry find connected hard disk how many hard disk I have connected in my machine the next one so how to find host name host name space hyphen yes so actually is a full host name is server.atol.com this corresponding host name have to see with help of command host name space hyphen yes it shows the host name host name is server the, the next one view server IP address how to view IP address server IP address cat slash etc sorry etc resolve.conf grep name server this is the server IP address 192.168.10.100 this is the command to we can view the server IP address the next one view router IP how to check or view I router IP one is a route command hyphen n so router IP address is 192.168.10.100 then one more command net stat iphone or the server dot aetl dot com see this is the server the, the ip address is 192 10 dot this is the command we can view or check the router ip address the next one how to check domain name with help of host name command with iphone d see aetl dot com is my domain name the next one find ram size dmi decode hyphen t17 grep mb so totally i have connected 2 gp nearly so this is the command to check ram size of the machine ok next find user information with the help of w command or uh, who so total who is a command is it is used for check the currently logged in user information and the finger finger command finger space a u tell so you want to know the particular user information finger space that user name then actually w command it shows some uh, space problem see w it will show the total number of user has been running how long my machine is running then uh, logged user information whether the idl are working total information it's showing in the w command then find out browser support virtualization technology or and then this machine it will support virtualization technology which is help of using command ls cpu actually this is 64 bit browser totally 4 core is there there is no virtualization technology so in this machine this is not support the next one find total number of running process in my machine ps ef WC hyphen L. So totally 242 process currently running in on my system. Then one more command to we can check top. See 
total number of running process then next <coughs> find system boot time who space hyphen p command is used to know the system boot time today i have boot 21 12 The next find how long my system is running using uptime so totally four days 32 minutes my machine is running totally three users logged then w command also we can see sorry it will uh, output will be uh, too long that's why it's showing some kind of message then top command see the first one four days three to minutes like that this is the command uh, to change the how long my system is running the next one I want to know my operating system bit it is whether 32 bit or 64 bit with help of <coughs> our command it is 64 bit then ls cpu see it's showing 64 bit in the top then uh, sorry uname hyphen p then hyphen m it will show the browser architect it is a 64 operating system so how to find browser is 32 bit or 64 bit use help of our command ls ls cpu uname hyphen p then uname hyphen m this command is used to check the browser bit the next find cpu cores core core see actually core i3 have totally eight core so like that uh, dual core have four core how to check with help of command number of browser core is a command it will show totally four core the next how to find cpu sorry browser name TMI decode hyphen T processor grub Intel it will show us the processor name actually it is a core i5 processor actually I will installed in uh, VMware it shows like okay not an issue but this is a command I used to check the processor name DMI decode hyphen T processor pipeline symbol grub Intel or uh, suppose you are using AMD means grub AMD you can use that one the next one how to find kernel version union iphone all so this is the kernel version 2.6 32 iphone 71 now latest version is uh, 289 something so you have to update yourself then th this is the command user to check the kernel version then next free command it will show the my total RAM size, how usage and free size it will show you. Okay, actually, I have connected 1.6 GP something in that 972 is using 650. Still, I have free space. This is the command to find RAM usage and free size, then find total number of running services. The next the next one is find total number of running services in Linux. Services hyphen hyphen status hyphen all grub only running running. It will show the running process in that use wc hyphen l. So totally 32 process sorry to 32 services running so this is the command to we can check total number of running services help of services service command the next broadcast message how to send wall hi a util admin it will broadcast the message who are all logging in that machine see i got a message suppose i will log in here wall demo 
earning as you can see see I have sent a message in uh, demo is running then I will so I will see in the putty see broadcast message tty2 is in demo running so so this is a command to send the broadcast message with the help of wall command okay this is the thing to have explained uh, about system admin information this is very much useful command for uh, in while doing in administration so thank you thank you so much